What a wonderful piece. That's Olivier Messiaen's uh, Transport de Joie from his Le Sancion organ suite. Hello, I'm Richard, and this is Beauty in Sound. And this video is actually me telling you about a Hauptwerk hack, which I do believe every Hauptwerk user should know about. And you will want to have it on your system after watching this video. Just imagine the scenario for one brief moment. You're playing a hymn, you're playing on the great the middle manual. You've got everything coupled through to the great, just like I normally do when I'm playing hymns. However, the next line, the next verse of the hymn, you want to have a solo stop. It might be a tuba or it might be a clarinet or whatever it is. The problem is you pull out that solo stop and because you've got everything coupled through to the great, naturally it will sound on the great. To get around that, you need to remove the uh, manual couplers to the grate and to the pedal. And in that split moment of adding the stop, doing the couplers, you know, you panic. Have I removed everything I need to remove? Is that tuba or clarinet going to sound on the grate? Am I going to look like a bit of a wally? I'm going to tell, uh, tell you and show you how to, through pressing only one button, you can be guaranteed that those couplers will be off the grate and you will be left with the a combination of couplers of your choosing. I think this is a wonderful Hauptwerk hack and I'm very, very happy to share it with you. Let, let's go onto the computer and I'll talk you through the steps. In Hauptwerk, we have loaded the extended version of Con. It's fantastic, actually. Um, it just adds one or two things which the original Sons Paradiso organ doesn't have and also rearranges the stops into a more um, AGO uh, conventional style. You'll see on the screen that I've got lots of stops on, pedal, swell, uh, great and choir, and also all of the couplers are engaged, which is, which is useful actually, because I, I can demonstrate this, um, this Hauptwerk hack. I want to remove the, um, the, the choir to great and the choir to pedal leaving swell to great, swell to pedal, and great to pedal. The holy trinity of couplers. I'm gonna press one button and let's see what happens. You see? So it took off um, choir to pedal, choir to great, and the octaves on the great and swell. Really, really useful. So to do that, um, let me just cancel these stops to get that really satisfying clump. What's one of the one of the best things about Halberg? <laughs> so we'll need a couple of. Um, by the way, you can have any organ loaded to do this. It doesn't matter. Any organ, indeed, it makes no difference at all. First thing you need to do is go to large floating control panels and get the master scoped combinations open. Scoped combinations are um, we can predefine these buttons to control any number of stops. For example, we can ask A1 to only affect, uh, I don't know, all of the pedal and all of the swell and nothing else. You know, gen general pistons are basically predetermined to control the entire organ and divisionals are predetermined to control that particular division, right? A scoped combination is customizable, basically. We can scope anything we want. It's fantastic, it's such a good tool. So you want that one open. You also want to go down to mini control panels and make sure you've got setter, general cancel, and so on, open. Okay? If you're using these scoped combinations, I, I, I'm using them for my swell, great, and quiet, and pedal, uh, find one that you're not using. For this example, I'm going to be using B10. If I press B10, you can see it brings on those couplers. I hope you're already seeing that this, this could bring great benefit to you. I promise you, you, you want this. So the first thing I want to do is tell these, that, that scoped button which stops that it is going to be interested in, okay? So in, in this case, we are creating um, a couplers button. So we want to uh, tell it to be interested in the couplers that we want it to enable, and but also the ones that we want it to take off in case we've got on. So 
Let me simply choose all of the couplers, enable all of the couplers. So in this case, there we go. All the couplers are now enabled to all the manuals. So then you want to click scope, and then you want to click setter. Now that will then tell B10, click B10, or whichever one you're using. Um, B10 is now programmed to alter only those eight stops, nothing else. Okay, so now disable setter, disable scope, and cancel everything. Okay. Now this is where it comes down to your own preference. For me, I like to have the uh, great to pedal, swell to pedal. I don't want to have, um, I don't want to have that one, because that's a naughty one. <laughs> I do want to have that. I want to have uh, swell to choir. And I do want to have swell to great. So this one over here uh, is a choir to pedal. And this one over here is a choir to great. Okay, so those four stops are the only ones that I need. At this point, then click setter, and we're gonna tell um, our divisional, our uh, scoped piston, sorry, that when we press that button, those are the stops, and only those stops are the ones we want engaged. Click. So now if we press Cancel again, and we press B10. Okay, another example, if I enable all stops, press B10, it takes off the ones we don't want and leaves the ones we do. Another example, cancel. If I engage just a whole bunch of stops down here, like that, and all of the couplers as well, let's imagine we're playing the the opening of that Messian again, get the 32 on. <laughs> the reeds over there, some mixtures, all that sort of stuff. Oh, let's have a string just for good measure. <laughs> um, okay, let's I demonstrate now that it won't uh, affect any of the speaking stops. Look at that, isn't that amazing? And you can then program that um, scoped button in just in a normal conventional way like you would with any you know, if you've got hardware stops or a launch pad, you can then uh, right click on it, auto detect, and then program it in whatever way you want. That's basically it for this Hauptwerk hack. I really, really hope that you find that useful, and I really hope that you put that onto your oven. Please leave a comment on this video if you found it useful, if you haven't found it useful as well. And also leave me a comment, um, your own Hauptwerk hacks. What do, you, what do you find useful um, that you might think people like me and other organists would find useful? Please subscribe if you haven't already, look out for future videos, and until the next Hauptwerk hack video, I will say cheerio. Goodbye. <laughs>